Hello healers! Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. This is another bigger card video and this one is all about uh, that person that you're not having contact, okay? No contact at all. And just to let you know in these cards if you will get a contact back from this person and when. I'll try to get some time frame. And also if not, if you should just uh, maybe give up or move on, you know, that kind of energy. So will they contact you back? Yes or no? When? If not, why? You know what uh, can you do that kind of energy okay so if you have someone there you're trying to figure out if they will contact you back or if you should uh, invest on this or not this is the video for you okay so just concentrate on that person and choose one of the piles like always go with your first choice it's most likely the right one but of course you can watch the full video and see which one resonates the most this is going to be group number one two and three just concentrate on the images, see which ones call you the first, you know, that's most likely the right one. As always, my details, the cards that I use, a way for you to support this channel, the timestamp, everything will be in the description below. And I also leave the timestamp on the first pinned comment, okay? And if this helps you out in any way, let me know, leave me a comment. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. So let me know if it helps you out. And if you're not yet, consider subscribing. You know, it helps the channel very much. If you subscribe, if you like this video, share if you want. You know, I'm really happy if you're coming back here. If you're already my subscriber, thanks very much for being here. And if you're new here, guys, make sure to stick around. You know, there are loads of video here, videos. I add videos uh, every, nearly every day in this channel. You know, there is a week ahead reading. I add every Saturday. I add a yes or no pick a card. If you have a question that is just a yes or no answer every Monday, there's always um, deck reviews and another videos, a longer video like this one here for relationship, career, anything that you wanted to ask as well. If you want me to create a pick a card video for you, I'll make sure to create one. So leave your comment with uh, suggestions. I'll be happy to create it, okay? And again, guys, this is group, group number one, two, and three. Timestamp below. Thanks for watching. Group number one, if you chose this pile here, we have here heart to heart conversation. And we have in the near future. We also have yes, straightforward yes here. I have the spiritual teacher. I'll read the full messages in a bit. We also have the tree of emotions and we have the six of wands and we have the other message here this is the card that you chose the front is forgiveness okay i read the full message in a bit wow beautiful here guys it's straight away group one you can see here yes okay yes this person will con will contact you back this person will or maybe they're already trying to just getting the courage to because there is a need for this heart to heart conversation right so it's something that they want to, it's from their side as well, okay? They want this hard, hard conversation, but I feel like they're trying to get the courage, okay? But it's showing in the near future, which is something we'll see here with the other cards as well. Because just uh, to not jump uh, here, but going to this card here without reading the full message, you can see the main, the key message here is forgiveness. So that's what I feel here when you go to this heart to heart conversation here is because there is needed okay honestly discuss your feelings with each other i know there's no contact right now but that's what they want as well okay and yes is here which means yes this person will contact you back and uh this when it's it's in the near future but we needed to see here it's because i feel this forgiveness plays a part here that they are trying to maybe forgive themselves, forgive you. you no, know, forgiving the situation is needed here. There's some hurt here. Maybe, you know, you cause hurt to each other or they know that they cause you some hurt and they have some guilt here as well. Okay, I have a feeling here of some guilt energy and that they needed to work on that to have the courage. That's why I feel like they, they, is, they are like building up on the courage to contact you because I feel like... Uh, at least for some of you guys, they hurt you. So, and they know that, okay? Maybe they are just holding on. Maybe it's something that you don't even know that there is some guilt there, okay? And let me just read the messages here because there, there are a few messages here, okay? We have the spiritual teacher and the message here. Just take what resonates, okay, guys? It's not the full message here related, but just so you have an idea here. The spiritual teacher is the hermit card, okay? There is a great reward in spending time alone. Use these moments of solitude to focus on love and ways in which you might give to those around you. Shine your light as an example for others to follow. Seek out a spiritual mentor of your own if your life 
uh, feels unfulfilled right now. And I feel like this is what's going on, right, with this person. Obviously, you are spending time apart right now and you are alone, like in this case, but that's what is happening with them as well. They're alone and this is a is a good time, okay, in this case, it's, it's going to be a beneficial for being alone because it's like there's a great reward in spending time alone and in this case i feel like it there's some growing up happening you know like they are in need of growing up and they are rethinking their actions and they maybe some of them are actually following like you see here seek out a, a mentor so maybe they are actually even asking help from others could be friends could be someone older could be just a um, you know family member i feel like they are reaching out to other people to get you know some advice at least you know some guidance just so you have an idea of what's going on as well and this time alone is beneficial for you too you know so just consider that that you could be maybe seeking out some help as well in in you know learning about you and um you know reaching out to friends as well so don't uh, Feel discouraged to to spend that you are apart right now because time alone in this case here will be beneficial on the long run all right and we have the six of uh action and this is the six of wands right so it's like um a reward at the end okay it's like after the battles you will see some results okay what a wonderful experience for you uh your project is a total success okay bringing a, a, awards promotions other recognition for the efforts so there will be some payback for this hard work, okay, for this time apart. So there will be, that's what I say, like, the time alone will be, uh, is a reward after. And I feel like this here, as the six of uh, ones really confirm that, like that celebration at the end, you know. And the three of emotions is uh, saying wonderful news is on its way. Again, you know, saying here, confirming this, yes, like, this is on its way. So this person will contact you back, Okay and announcements of course this doesn't not the whole message here is um, related to the situation but i mean the tree of emotions is the tree of cups which is showing that celebration okay the time to really be happy okay and um bringing back this is essentially exciting new beginnings it's like i feel like it's it's a new chance in this relationship okay guys and uh but they will contact you back. It's saying here, yes, it's straightforward here, right? But there is a need for this hard, hard conversation. And with the forgiveness here, you can see that the, the message here is, is stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think, dream and imagine. This is really important here in this connection, guys, because forgiveness is needed here. And there's a need for both of you in this case to stop focusing on the energy. And I feel like this is what the time alone is happening right now. It's a chance for this forgiveness to actually, you know, to really move here because maybe it's not uh, easy to forgive in this case. You know what's, what's happening there for you, of course, and uh, how they hurt you. I feel like many of you, they hurt you, okay? But it could be that you hurt them too. So they need to forgive you too. And you need to maybe forgive yourself first. And I feel like they need to forgive themselves to allow this to flow naturally. And then it, have the courage to talk and have this heart-to-heart -heart conversation, honestly discussing the feelings, you know? But yes, it's here. And I feel like because this is saying in the near future, I feel like this here is important with this focus of energy. Okay, I feel like this energy here can play a big part of how soon this near future will be, right? And obviously, they are working on themselves too, and you need to allow that, but you need to do your part. What you can do is focus this energy of releasing the past, things that you can't change, but bringing the forgiveness. Not that it's easy, right, guys? It's just about the, the way, like you're at least trying to refocus here, you know, stop focusing on the energy of the past events. Maybe you're replaying, even on their side, okay? I feel like they're replaying the conversations, the things that happen, and like, um, that's why it stops them at some point to, to reach out, you know, you know, when they focus on the negative events, on the things that, um, you know, didn't ha help so far and they were upset or, the situations that brought to this point of no connection. I feel like when they focus on that, that's why it is stopping so far. So there's still an energy there of being um, stopped because of the forgiveness it still needs to flow, right? So it's something that's being worked right now. And I feel like with this time alone, reaching out maybe to help, um, helping with friends or mentor or some kind of guidance, okay? Talking to other people. And I feel like this is important time. It's like a 
the need to grow here, right? And uh, I feel like if you as well focus the energy on the present, you know, the things that you can bring and focus on the, the things that you want, your dreams, okay? Like uh, keeping that positive frame of mind and uh, imagine things already working out, releasing the negativity. Many times we are the ones creating these blocks, you know, and we, we bring this, this energy walls that stop this person to reach out is stop the good things to come to flow your way okay guys so i feel like this near future the time frame here will depend of you as well so if you can do your part of releasing the the negativity you know this energy the past event not that it's easy okay that's what i'm saying like it's easier said than done but you know we have this focus at least if we can focus on the positive you know don't waste any time you create your reality by what you think dream and imagine so create this reality of positivity of focusing on the forgiveness on bringing this person back and yes is here okay it's like yes they will contact you back and i feel like this near future you can control in a way you know this time frame i feel like you can definitely bring this sooner into your reality okay and this heart to heart conversation will happen because say yes heart to heart conversation then the celebration cards are here confirming it's like your hard work of forgiveness, of working on yourself, of them working on themselves as well, because that's what I feel they are doing as well, okay? There's growing up, there's like moving forward, okay? And um, having to release things and uh, this will be paid back, okay? There will be a payback for this hard work. I feel like they, they need this time, the time apart, like the Hermit card is saying, it's going to be a benefit for both of you. So just take this time, to focus on forgiveness, on the positive things that you want, and then celebration is here waiting for you, okay? That's what I have here for you, group one. Definitely yes, okay? And I feel like you are you can control this near future, okay? Like uh, coming sooner to you, depending on how you work on yourself right now. So you can release the energy of bad things and just concentrate and focus on the good ones, okay? But yes, okay, guys, for you. They will contact you back. So that's what I have group one. I hope this helps you out. And like always, let me know, leave me a comment, you know, let me know if it helps you in any way, if it resonates, if you know what's going on here. But as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful image here for the pile two, will they contact you back? What's going on here? We have attraction. We also have look for a sign. We have within the next few weeks there is uh, some tarot cards as well is the four of emotions helper of action ace of action i'll read the message in a bit and we have manifesting miracles which i will also read the full message okay that's lovely here group two straight away here attraction right so there is still attraction there there is still the feelings are still there attraction okay so you don't need to worry like maybe some of you are thinking that they don't care anymore and all they the attraction is still there okay this connection this energy is still there okay there's romance okay uh, you attract romantic uh, love and uh, so it's like this is the romantic love is still there okay so the feelings are there and you don't need it to like think they don't care at all in this case it's just a matter of time here because we did it, it's saying here look for a sign okay so I feel like this is something that is already happening there that they wanted to contact you. Maybe they have already checked you in social media. You know, that's what's coming to me in my mind now. It's like there are some signs that they are around, okay? And then maybe you you heard about another person or friend in common asking about you, ask, knowing that um, the other one was asking about you. Some kind of sign, okay? And even signs maybe that you are having. You're having seeing repeated numbers. You're having dreams, like specific signs, okay? And that we have within the next few weeks. So I feel like this here is very important. In the next few weeks, you can find the resolutions with this person contact you. But there's more going on, okay? Because you have manifesting miracles here. And I read more of the other cards so we understand more what's going on here. So I feel like, guys, there's some signs here that things are already happening, okay? Like this person, I have no doubt here, will contact you in the next few weeks, okay? So, but there's more going on here. So let's understand here with the other cards, okay? And we have here the four of emotions, okay? Which is the four of cups. And not the full message will apply here, but just so you have an idea, okay? There are wonderful people who wish to help you. Opportunities are being offered to you. 
but you are noticing or trusting the gift have the gifts heaven is bestowing upon you look around you daydreaming or going within is a healthy way to get clarity as long as you act upon your dreams okay guys i feel like this is connected with the signs okay because they look for a sign here and they're saying there are people that are trying to help you maybe there was a friend that was trying to help you maybe that you have a friend in common you know guys like always take what resonates but they say here like there is already some gifts that heaven is bestowing upon you in like i said it could be just a dream it could be a sign it could be repeated numbers just showing that it's time for you to connect with what you want okay like connect with that energy bringing this person back to you you can do your part to open this energy okay for this few weeks to come sooner all right so but that's it's saying here maybe you are missing out uh maybe you didn't notice that uh, they are checking you that they are liking your pictures or there is someone uh, um already that is asking telling you that they asked about you you oh, know that kind of there's some signs okay like always i say like take what resonates because everybody could be having different signs here but there's signs that they are already trying to contact you or they are coming closer okay but we also have here helper of action okay and the message here is you're blessed with many wonderful things to do it would be great if you could take the time to make a plan first but you probably don't have the time so get busy follow your instincts and have fun you or someone you meet is very self-assured capable and enthusiastic and can do anything with a smile so i feel like this is the, this person right they can do things with a smile they can be very assured of themselves they are capable and they're enthusiastic and i feel like they are trying to bring this energy back okay because obviously if you have not been in contact this is not always the energy that they had like enthusiastic help you know being happy with the, the situation but i feel like they are trying to bring this back okay they can do anything with a smile so i feel like they're trying to bring this back okay this connection back and uh, i feel like they're getting the courage to get there okay and um, this is action okay so this is like very much related to passion because the helper of action is the knight of wands is like act you know to do the things that they want to so i feel like they're getting this motivation to do it okay because obviously things are if you're not connected right now something went uh, bad right so maybe they were concentrating in that energy and they're trying to bring that back that positivity back okay doing things with a smile and that passion back doing things that they want okay the action they are opening them and ace of action which is the again more action is the ones again more more fire more um passion here is the ace of ones right and it's saying here this carob is heralding a time of wonderful new opportunities related to your creativity career pursuing your dreams this is a card of action and if you've been procrastinating it's time to really get busy it's also a great time to start a new business have confidence in your abilities we're not talking about the business here side but also but we are talking about pursuing your dreams right if this person is um part of your dreams that in the passions the things that you want in your life so i feel like the ace of wands here and the ace of action again represents the that door okay the chance the opportunity for this person to contact you back and i do feel here like uh, have confidence in your abilities so if you do feel guys for some of you at least i do feel here group two that you can reach out as well okay if there is a message that you wanted to send if there is maybe just a like on a picture that you wanted to do you know in their social media anything like that that you do you do want to Take some kind of action towards uh, bringing this person back or just showing that you still care. I feel like uh, you can do this, okay? Maybe you don't want to completely reach out and uh, call and say, you know, let's talk or anything so direct. But if you wanted to do something, I feel like you can as well. I feel like you can um, just show in a way, like indirect way, if you want that you care, okay? So just so they know as well, because I feel like they are working towards the courage to contact you and trying to bring that, um, you know, the courage that they have as the Knight of Wands to contact you back and look for the signs as well. Remember the signs. So these signs could be that you are sending them a sign as well. You are sending them this sign that you still care. You still want to contact them, or you, you know, if that's what you want, right guys? Because in this case here it's like there is no contact but if you want them back show as well that you care okay there is a way to show here maybe it's not direct saying let's talk but it's something like something simple like i said maybe you like a picture maybe you you do send a message but not something so specifically saying let's talk but just saying uh, i hope you're doing well in this time of you know 
that we all isolated or that kind of situation. You know, guys, like always, uh, think what resonates and see what is resonating there in your heart, that what you should do, okay? Because we do have manifesting miracles here. And the message here is your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. And I feel like, again, this is here. For some of you in your heart, you will be feeling that you should reach out. And you can. And like I said, it may not be direct saying, uh, uh, we need to talk, let's talk, or anything so specific. But you may want to send a message asking, how are you? You know, something simple, just to show that you care. I feel like it's important for some of you, at least, guys. But in any case, within the next few weeks, this person is contacting you, okay? And few weeks could be just a couple of weeks, could be through two, three weeks, right? For depending of the situation that you are. But I feel like you play a part here of bringing this sooner because few weeks could still be six weeks, right? So it could be two, it could be six. But I feel like you can play a part here because this, there's lots of actions here. So it's like some action, some sign that you can send to this person as well, showing that you care. And uh, you can manifest this as well. It's like you do your part. And I feel like this uh, few weeks can come sooner rather than later, okay? But if you don't do anything, no matter what, I feel like this person is trying to really build up, okay? That courage, build up that passion, build up that fire to contact you back, okay? And uh, in this case, they need, they need some weeks, okay? To doing that because obviously things... Um, ended up this way for a reason and like always both sides need to be working on healing on the on growing up on understanding why things happen to not repeat the patterns right so you can move on from this in a way that you can contact again and uh, if is the case having a new phase in a relationship but in growing up right because there's no point of reaching out and uh, going back to repeat the same mistakes. It's always about growing up. So I feel like this time apart is really important for you to learn why things happen this way. So when you have this chance to communicate again, you don't repeat the patterns, right? So you learn from this experience. So you, you two can move uh, forward together, but more grown up, more understanding why things happen and what you can avoid, right? So you can manifest these miracles. You can manifest this relationship that really is fulfilled, really is going somewhere. And, um, you know, and remember here, trust your heart, guys. If your heart is telling you that you can reach out, I feel like you can as well. Okay. I feel like for group two, you do have these actions and actions that can come from you as well. And, and pay attention to the signs, signs that um, they are sending to you and signs that you can send to them. Okay. That's what I have here for your group too. Yes, within the next few weeks, okay? It, this person will contact you back. But there is something maybe you can do as well. For some of you, if you feel like, I feel like you can do that. Reach out as well, okay? That's what I have here. Let me know if you have to help in any way. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed, and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number three, if you chose this beautiful pile here. They contact you. We have here, you deserve love. We have... Ask your angels. We also have choose a new direction. We have the seven of emotions, five of emotions, ace of emotions. And you have this longer message here that I'll read for you in a bit, okay? Because they all have some long messages. Okay, group three. Interesting here. It says straight away here, you deserve love, okay? You are lovable. You need to remember that, okay? It's a time for you to focus here on you as well, right? It's saying here, you deserve love. So you deserve a love that uh, really is someone that uh, wants to be there, you know, cares about you, like uh, the full package, okay? Whatever you have to bring, they like you for you, right? So you deserve love. Remember that. And say here, ask your angels. I feel like uh, it's a time for you to connect uh, it doesn't mean angels specifically, whatever you connect with, okay, higher powers there, anything that you connect with, if you can, I feel like it's a time, okay, even if you don't connect with anything specifically, just some time for you to meditate, okay, like take time for yourself, connect with something that can bring you some inner wisdom and help you with the direction, because it's showing here choose a new direction. So I feel like this person may be choosing a new direction as well, okay, so I feel like they could be going towards maybe meeting other people, choosing new direction, maybe trying to just to stay alone. I feel like this person here is a little bit hidden here. This the the way here for them. I don't I don't see here the energy of them reaching out yet. 
at least not now okay guys it's like choosing a new direction and there's a lot of emotions here because all this uh the cups right you have the ace of cups the five of cups the seven of cups and it's a lot of emotions so i feel like it could be very emotional time for you and you could be worried about this or stressing out overthinking and uh, it's really i needed to release some energy here as well okay i read the message here for you the seven of emotions your angels are asking you to make an important decision that you've been putting off it's likely you know which choice you should make but you're procrastinating so you don't upset someone someone else ask heaven for guidance and then make the choice that celebrates who you truly are I feel like this is very connected here, like that you deserve love, right? When you focus on yourself, you know, there is a decision there for your group tree that you needed to make, right? It may be hard to cut away this uh, situation from your life, but it's like, it's a hard decision that, but you know, in your heart, you know, that uh, you're just putting off, but you know that this should be made, right? It's, it's about focusing on you here. Okay, guys. And uh, this here as well. So the... Um, Ace of emotions, right? This carob is announcing that a wonderful new emotional experience is coming into your life. You may meet someone new who makes you, your heart uh, flutter of your current um, or your current relationship will experience re reawakening. It's also possible that you, your intuitive abilities will be greatly appreciated by your open heart it's like you need to open heart for new beginnings you see here guys it's like this chance for new beginnings for you right so it's like i feel in this case here is is a new uh is someone new that you could be blocking here so and i feel like this person like they they are focusing in new directions right and i and i feel for some that they could be focusing already on someone else or just focus on, on themselves, right? But they are, I don't see them reaching out here, not for um, rekindle their relationship, right? They could still reach out to just talk and uh, have some closure, but I don't see like uh, reaching out for things to progress, right? Not, not the energy here right now, at least. And the five of emotions is forgiveness is an important part of healing. Forgive yourself and those around you for any mistakes of the past so that everyone can move forward. Grieving is a normal part of life. Ask your angels or those you love to help you move through the process quickly so that you can get back on the path path to joy. Very, very important here, guys. Forgiveness here in this case. And one more time, he's saying reach out to your angels and he's getting, asking here, ask your angels or like ask that friend to help you out, you know. It's like a time to release this energy, right? It doesn't mean that you'll never come around, guys. It's just right now, I don't see them uh, coming around here. I feel like there's a new direction that they are choosing and you could choose as well because you can allow that um, ace of emotions, ace of cups coming to you. And it's like this new opportunity. You actually could be holding on uh, this energy and it's blocking the next person, this, this nicer energy coming your way. I feel like... Um, you know, you really can focus on you and allow this healing because obviously there's a need for healing. And I feel like they are, they are connected to that as well. Okay. It's not just your side because you know here, uh, if it ended up this way, it's because there was a uh, hurting, you know, from both sides, you could be that you hurt each other and the situation there's a need for healing here. And I feel like they're focusing on themselves on healing as well. But for this new direction here, for some reason, some of them, I feel like it's connecting with uh, someone else as well. Okay, guys. And um, so healing is really important here. It's like you needed to focus on you, the healing. Grieving is a normal part of life. You know, ask your angels. And again here, ask your angels. It's, like, it's, it's the same phrase in different decks. I, you know that I don't pick and choose these cards. So it's like, ask your angels again. So if you can, guys, connect with higher powers. I know healing is not always an easy process, you know, especially if you know someone else, um, yeah, you know did hurt you and i feel like for some of you this person really hurt you here and um you know they are moving into new directions maybe blocking you you know doing things to really show to you that uh, they uh, they are not uh, coming back so it's really um an energy that you need to heal here because like i said when you don't heal when you don't deal with the situation specifically you build these walls and then you could be blind to see this other person that is coming your way and could be so helpful and really this relationship that you deserve you know like uh, someone that can really love you for who you are 
and be there for you and you could be blocking because this energy will you know will stop this next person coming to you and i feel like there is someone because of the ace of emotions there i really feel like it's someone else we do have also the message here right the past is now behind you release it and embrace new possibilities a new path is now available to you follow it with faith very much connected here guys this is the card that you chose in the front okay this is the message right so the past is now behind you it's like it's a need to release you can see here release it and embrace new possibilities and i feel like it's very much connected with like releasing this energy and then the new possibility the new person that is there for you you know you can embrace this and you can allow this new person this new chance this new love coming your way Okay, guys, it's not easy, right? It's not easy because obviously there's hurt, there's a need for healing, forgiveness. You may need to forgive yourself to allow this forgiveness to this other person. You know, guys, how hard uh, the situation was. Maybe for some of you it's more than others, but um, maybe for some for some of you it's not uh, it's not uh, someone that you had for too long. It's not a big deal. You just need to deal with it and then move on. But some of you, I feel, could be something longer that uh, maybe is even a broken marriage for some of you, something that is deeper, okay? Like for longer, okay? My, like years. So guys, just work on you, okay? Remember here, the first card was you deserve love. So remember that you deserve love. Don't forget that. Don't think that um, whatever they did to you or whatever the situation ended up being, even if like you hurt each other, it doesn't mean that you don't deserve love. So remember that you always deserve love. You can always focus on yourself, on healing. And um, not uh, that it's easy, but it's uh, needed, you know, to work on you, to focus on you. And maybe meditation, maybe contacting in uh, friends or, you know, reaching out and being able to connect with higher powers, angels, anything that you believe right now. It could be very helpful for you to reach out and read maybe a book and things that uh, are connected to spirituality and healing. Okay, it can be really, really beneficial for you. But once you release these guys, you, you, may, you may be looking back and then understanding why this happened and then understanding how this was really a uh, learning, a lesson for you to know in the future what you really want in a relationship, what you really allow, where your boundaries are, and how to be honest and straightforward with someone, okay? I don't see this person contacting you guys, and this is the reason, And um, but it's really a need for you guys to focus on you and uh, release and embrace this new opportunity, okay? Don't miss out on these new opportunities, guys, because there is a new path for you, and it's a path that you really will bring you happiness and you will look back and you will understand on this okay a new path is now available so it's now available it's already available for you guys remember that okay i feel like there's someone already there waiting for you if you you know go through this healing process and then you can be ready for the next okay and um, follow it with faith okay which is not again connected here with the angels with your faith with any anything that you believe i feel like it will help you very much because follow with faith, faith that you know you're doing the right thing for you, okay? I don't see them uh, contacting you, at least not right now, guys. Maybe there is a contact in the future here for like closure, for like understanding. But there is a lot of growing up, I feel, from their side in order to come around, okay? Like there's really a need to grow up and uh, be able to talk again uh, in this case. Like there's lots of work on their side as well, okay? I feel like focus on you because on their side, it's going to take some time as well, okay? That's what I have here, group three. I know it's not always easy, but it's a need here. And uh, you will see, you'll look back and you'll feel much better because you'll be in a much uh, beautiful path here that's waiting for you. So there's a new person, a new energy here waiting for you. There's a new path, okay? You deserve love. Don't forget that. That's what I have here for you, group three. All the best with this, you know, focus on you. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching.